Now, a couple of weeks ago, we brought you some different science experiments that I did over at the South Dakota School of Mines. Now, what we're looking at here today is, or the last time, we brought you some, uh, some uh, kind of a trick that you could do with matches. Now, today, we're doing what is called elephant toothpaste. Just take a look. All right, so in this science segment, we have moved outside. It's a beautiful day. We're here at the South Dakota School of Mines once again with Dr. Meyer. Now, Dr. Meyer, what are we going to be doing today? Because we moved outside, so I'm guessing it's going to be pretty cool. Yeah, we kind of need a little bit more uh, ceiling space, so we decided to move outside here. Okay. This is kind of a chemist traditional favorite, elephant's toothpaste. Many people have maybe seen it. Uh, what basically elephant's toothpaste is, is we're taking some hydrogen peroxide. So what Hydro we do is we put some soap in there. Just some regular This is just soap? just some regular dish soap. Okay. Uh, put a little food coloring in there just to make it look cool too. Okay. And then we're going to put a stopper on after I add the chemical that has a small hole, and that's going to get things to go up in the air. So after I do this, we're gonna to wanna to take a few steps back. Okay, I like okay. it. Okay, ready? Yes, I'm ready. When it kicks in, we're gonna see the bubbles come up and we see it starting to rise there now. Right oh, now, yeah. but when it gets to the neck of that, it's gonna go out up really fast. Whoa! All over the chemicals. If someone wants to try this at home, of course, use proper supervision. Yep. The hydrogen peroxide you buy at the store is 3%. This is 10 times more concentrated. So that stuff, of course, you can buy. Uh, what you can also use instead of the potassium iodide is, is uh, yeast. Uh, oh, okay. If you take yeast and dissolve it in water, get it activated and add that, you will see this, but it won't be quite as, uh, it won't happen as fast. Okay. All right, guys, that, what was that? Elephant's, Elephant's tooth toothpaste Elephant's is what we call it. Elephant's toothpaste, right there. And then like you said, you can give it a shot for yourself at the house. All right, thanks, Dr. Meyer. So I love that one right there. Like you said, you can do it for yourself. You can get, you can buy everything you need at the store there, the peroxide, and then also just get some yeast, dissolve it in water. You pour that in, add some dish soap and uh, some food coloring. Maybe not as big as what we saw there, but uh, still pretty cool. Just give that a try for yourself at the